Well, I wasn't really sure what the project was going to be all about. Um, and then when Andy got halfway through the middle of it, I thought, oh, this is going to be brilliant. I'd heard of Brilliant Derby, but it was when the children came back and they were really excited. I thought, I need to pay attention to this. Then we got a book that told you all about it. And then I thought, this is going to be brilliant. The class is going to love this project. It's been absolutely amazing. I think the children have really taken it on board. Um, the confidence that has grown from January even to now is, is just blown me away. We've been doing presentations, we've been going around the classes and we've been doing like stuff in the newspaper. I'm very proud of them. I just feel really proud that they have not only um, decided to adopt this message but thought it was good enough to go around and, and spread to everyone. WI, um, uh, Rolls Royce members, um, the um, governors, uh, lots of different people and of course we've been around the different classes. What bit of being a teacher was the best part? <laughs> oh, Tommy. Being in charge of a whole class. Being in charge. Was it hard? Quite, yeah. yeah. I mean, some of these children went to year six, which is older children, um, and they'd got the PowerPoints that went wrong, and they'd got the presentations that weren't quite right in the right order, and they just dealt with it, just like a teacher would. And when, when we say, you know, they were teachers for the day, they really were. The teachers sat at the back of the classroom and took photos. Well, I enjoyed doing the newspaper. I was in the first issue with uh, about five other people. It's the embodiment of personalised learning. It's the children deciding how they want to learn, what they want to learn, and taking that on, and being really, really positive about it. I think it's amazing how it's improved everyone's attitude in their learning. Uh, well, I used to be like, uh, really worrying about the things that I didn't really enjoy doing. I absolutely hated maths. The, the one thing that I'd look on a morning and think, oh no, maths, maths, not maths, anything but maths. And I'd come in and I'd try and sit at the back if I could so I wouldn't be asked a question. There's no point sitting at the back of the classroom thinking I can't do this because you're going to have to do everything at some stage. So I think it's better just to get it over with and think for the best with it. I like learning, but I was used to just kind of like get a t bit bored sometimes when the teacher just kept on going on. But now, I've, since Brilliant Derby, I've been really listening and I like... Who's responsible for your learning now? Is it, is it, is it Mrs Edwards? Me. 20 years of teaching, dare I say it. Um, this has been the biggest impact on children in my experience. Um, lots of initiatives come, come in through the government, through funding that we get, but actually looking at the whole child and how a child feels about themselves um, actually really does make a difference. The children now feel, I mean you've heard the children speak, they feel that they've got this can-do attitude, that nothing's going to hold them back, and so far nothing is. Before Brilliant Derby, I didn't have the positivity um, in my learning. I can see a lot of people's attitude towards learning has changed. They've all surprised me. I think because they've taken it on with such gusto and they've been uh, really convinced about it. Um, and I think probably what's been the most surprising is how mature they've seemed in spreading the message to their peers uh, around school. I think it will keep going. I think it's going to be passed down every year five class will know about it and keep it going through the school and then as we grow up into our high school wherever we're going really we can also pass it on to them and make it spread and keep spreading it i know what it's like i know how busy we are um but i would say do think about it because in actual fact it enhances the learning. I used to get really worked up in tests. I thought I didn't do very well. But now Brilliant Derby here, I, I know that I can do well. Um, I think it's had a positive effect on the results. When I did the presentation, we looked at all the results and most of us have passed year six. All of us have passed the year six standard. So it's really helped. We can look at what we expected, what we predicted based on prior performance, and we can see an improvement. 
um, for some individuals that's quite marked. Um, the end of year test results show that they've actually you know, shot through the roof with 46% um, in reading for instance already reaching their level uh, year six end of year target. Genuinely, I, do you mean that it's made a difference or, or is that something that you just think you ought to say or is it, has it really made a difference? Yeah, it's really made a difference.